Hello everybody, my name is Thomas Schimpf with the Synchro team from Bentley. Today we're going to take a look at how Synchro connects the office and the field with its suite of solutions. So as you can see here, I'm in my Synchro control project. If we jump over to our iModel setup, you can see we have set this iModel for scheduling service. So what this does is create a correlation between 40 Pro, our desktop scheduling solution, Control, our project management cloud solution, and Field, our mobile solution. It will create a relationship between all three, allowing direct communication between the office and the field. Now if we jump over to 40 Pro, we can open our control project by selecting File, Open, and Control Project. This is going to give me a list of all the projects I'm a member of, and now I can select the project I want to open. We can now see our iModel from Control, and a schedule has already been added and linked. Now I want to add a task to my schedule by going to Create and Choose Below and giving it a name. Now we can go back to Control and see this added task in the Schedule module. As you can see in our schedule module, we have our demo task for control schedule we created in 40 Pro. Now any member of the construction team can review the sequencing, task information, and up-to-date schedule progress at any time. Now let's jump over to the field app and create an issue using a digital form. On the job site, we can use the field app to view the documents added in control by the construction team in the office. We can mark these documents up in the field. Let's draw a cloud to identify the area of issue and create an issue form directly from the document. We just need to fill out the required information on our form. Now let's go back to control and as you can see the form is now available for the team in the office to view. And when we open up the form, the marked up document is attached. Now let's jump back to 40 Pro and set up resource statuses to help us identify statuses such as procurement, progress, inspections, or any objects that you want to color code and track. We can even use resource statuses to update our schedules from the field. Now you can see for our steel procurement resource statuses, we have blue as ordered, yellow as shipped, green as received, and red as late. Now we can jump to the still progress and we have the green as erected, orange as torqued, and blue as welded. And for concrete, we have formed, reinforced, and poured, color coded as well. We can easily see just by looking at the model what status they are and the progress that has been made on our project. We can even set up our percentage progress for our resource statuses. So anything that is formed status will have a percent complete of 25%, reinforced 60%, and poured 100%. If we go back to our field app, we can open up our status update module here. Let's select our structural framing area one. This will highlight all the resources assigned to this task. Now we can select the update status option and it will bring us to the resource statuses created and assigned in 40 Pro. Using the field app, we can see everything that has been ordered, shipped, received, and update the statuses from the field. Let's say these three late uprates have been delivered. We can select them and update their statuses as received. We can now see there they are green and we only have two red late uprights left. Now we can switch over to the steel progress status. We can again easily see what has been torqued and welded based on the colors. Let's say we have welded this upright and a few of the cross members. Next, we can update the progress of our concrete. We can scroll down to our slab on grade area two task and we can see the sign resources are highlighted. We can see the concrete has been formed. So now we wanna update it to reinforced. Now that we have everything updated, we can go back to our homepage and synchronize our updates back to 40 Pro. To do this, simply select the Sync All Status Updates. As you can see, the iModel in 40 Pro has been updated to reflect the updates in the field app. Our three uprates are now green and received.
If we jump over to our concrete progress, we can see our slab on grade 2 has been updated to reinforced and is now purple. Let's scroll down in our schedule to our slab on grade area 2 task and we can see it is set to 25% progress. Now in the recalculate task progress screen, we can analyze the progress updates from the field. As a scheduler, I want to do a quick audit to ensure everything looks accurate and select run to update my schedule. We can see in the report that my slab on grade area 2 task has been updated to 60% and when we look at the Gantt chart, we can see it has been updated there as well. These are just a few features that you can set up in Synchro to have direct communication between the office and the field to increase efficiency within your construction project.